uh, my family's on your Facebook and see if any of your friends want to come in. I'm oh, sorry, it's hard for me to hear. My headphones on. How's it going, murder train? Or just go to my Facebook and copy the link that I posted.
complicated I guess but from what I gather apparently I'm some prince of some town uh, my character and I'm avenging my father I believe is what's going on uh, you could wiki it I guess like the translations with these games aren't very good from what I gather so one of my buddies uh, really wanted me to play this game because he, he loves it so much, so I decided to try it out. Apparently. Is my mic that loud? chapter 3 or 4. I don't know how many chapters are in a book, but uh, from what I've read on wiki, um, book 1 and 2, I think, uh, like book and 1 and 2 are like a, cert or a set story, and then like 3 is a different story that you play different characters entirely or something, but I'm not that far. I've never played any of the Shining Force games. I played uh, the very first one for Sega Genesis. I never beat it, I didn't get very far. best uh, RPGs for the, the Sega. The Super Nintendo had all the sweet ones. But there's like a, a Secret of Mana too. It's pretty sweet from what I played. But, uh, thanks for finally coming in and checking out the stream though. Posted. I get post on Facebook every time I go live. Which I'm probably not going to stream too late tonight until I get to open the store in the morning. Yeah. 
the menu. I'm just talking to myself. stream games that uh, don't require internet connection or use internet bandwidth. So I just decided to start streaming streaming this game because my buddy wanted me to play it. So I was uh, streaming uh, Dragon Quest. Dragon Quest 8 I think is what it was. My buddy says that this game is way, way better. So. Which I kind of had an idea because I played a little bit of the first time close. But from what I read on Wiki, I guess this is the best translated game. Translated in English or whatever. I don't know. I haven't been following the story too well. I mean, technically, there's not really too much of a story. Basically, it's just uh, your tactical strategy of defeating this dungeon or wherever you're in. There's just a little side thing or side uh, story here. Yeah, for sure. I mean, this is, and this is on uh, the Sega CD, which I've, I've never owned or I don't even know anyone that owns a Sega CD. But, uh, yeah, for a game that was made, I guess it was made in 94, if I'm not mistaken. It's pretty good. And I'm thinking about playing, uh, you know, I don't know for sure what I'm going to do yet, but maybe after this book, or just, I don't know, I don't, I don't know if I'm going to play all the way through this game. I mean, it's <laughs> it seems pretty long. It's because I haven't even made it to the second book yet. And there's four books, and it is pretty repetitive. I have to say, I might just take a break from it and stream a different game, or. But I, uh, I did get my PS2 emulator to work, so... Oh, like the same thing over and over? Is that what you mean? You know, this is just a huge, huge grind game so far. 